The family of 37-year-old Aquino Britton has been left grief-stricken following his tragic death. Monday, the beloved taxi driver, also known as Booby Nile, succumbed to stab wounds he suffered during an altercation, allegedly with AJUTC bus driver. In the evening, his widow, Nastasia Tomlinson Britton, in an interview on Tuesday, recalled receiving the heartbreaking phone call that changed her life that her husband of two years had been killed. She stated that I ran from Hagley Park Road in the rain to Halfway Tree to get someone to take me to the hospital. Tomlinson Britton also stated that she had spoken to her husband approximately 15 minutes prior to the incident, when she had asked him to pick up their child from school. In the meantime, the slain driver's uncle suggested that road rage was at the center of the dispute between Britton and the man said to have inflicted the fatal stab wounds. The bus man bad drive him and he was talking to the bus man. And the bus man just come out and stab him, the uncle, who declined to reveal his name, told Loop News. It is believed that the shooting death of a JUTC employee later Monday night was an act of reprisal to Britain's killing triggering tensions between some taxi operators and some employees of the JUTC. The development led to drivers of the state-owned bus company withdrawing their services Tuesday. Against that background, Britain's uncle has urged Kalmazir, We really don't want the thing to get out of hand. We don't want anyone else to die, he said. Thanks for listening. Please subscribe for more Jamaican breaking news.